Welcome back, campers and parents. My name is Miss Angelina, and this week's theme is one of my favorites. It is Animal Planet. So for my craft today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to make paper ring snakes. To make a paper ring snake, all you need is a couple of sheets of paper. They can be plain or colored. You need any type of coloring materials. I'm going to be using markers. You need scissors, tape, or a stapler, and then googly eyes are always an option. So to start off this craft, what I'm going to be starting with is I'm going to be grabbing my sheet of paper, and I have markers here, and I'm going to be making my snake skin. So I'm going to be coloring this whole sheet of paper, filling it up with color. I'm probably going to make some like scale looking designs. So you want to do that first, add any design you want to your paper, and then afterwards we're going to be cutting the paper. So here in a second I'll show you what my finished snake skin looks like. <clears throat> Alright, so these are my snake skin designs. So I got some diamonds, some ovals, and some triangles, and then some plain space of color. So what you're going to do next is you're going to grab your scissors and I'm going to be cutting this um, probably from the long side. So I'm going to have my paper landscape like this. You can cut them like this and cut your strips down like that. That'll give you longer strips. But I drew my designs like going down like this. So I'm going to be cutting my designs just like that wherever the color splits. And then after that, we're going to be making our rings. So I'm gonna show you, I'm going to be cutting one ring like this. And I'm gonna cut the rest of them about this size. And you can vary your sizes of paper, however wide or however long you want. I think I'm gonna stick with this size throughout. So after I cut the rest of these, I'm going to show you guys how to make your rings. Okay, so I have my multiple strips of paper. So what you're going to do next is you're going to grab one sheet of paper. You're going to fold it up into a circle so that the pieces of paper overlap just a little. And then you're going to grab a piece of tape and you're going to tape where it overlaps just like this so that it keeps your circle like that so now how to connect the snake is grab another sheet of paper and loop it through the inside of the one circle and then make another circle just like that and then they'll be attached and you keep doing that and adding more tape and paper and you can make your snake as long as you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish my snake up and I'll show you what he looks like here in a second. All right, campers, so this is what my snake skin looks like so far. I went ahead and colored another sheet of paper with more designs just because I wanted to make my snake a little longer. You guys can keep continuing with adding more loops of paper and rings um, but I think I like the size of my snake for now. What I'm going to go ahead is I'm going to go and add some eyes and maybe a tongue right there. I think that's what he's missing. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm just going to add it with markers. If you guys have googly eyes, feel free to add googly eyes or anything else. This is what my final craft looks like, campers. I'm pretty excited with how it turned out. I've never seen a real snake like this, but it sure is a pretty snake. Here in a second, I'm going to show you some modifications for this craft. All right, campers. So the modifications for this craft would be beginner. If you don't feel like coloring your paper and making your own scales like that, no worries. An easy way out of that is to grab colored paper, construction paper, and it's already full of color, so you can go ahead and cut your slits and tape your rings together and your snake is already full of color. For intermediate, 
You can do what I did, grab plain sheets of paper and then color them however you would like. Add scales in your own designs, make your snake come alive and try making more than one snake. I might do that. Um, these snakes are pretty cool. For the advanced level, I want you guys to draw almost like real live looking snakes. So look up a picture of a real snake and try to copy that. I think that'll be awesome and make your snake come to life. Also try making a family of snakes. All right, campers, that is it for this craft for the paper ring snakes. And I think my dog likes him. <laughs>